I'm betting at some point in your life, you thought to yourself, I don't like where I am, I don't like what I do, or what I stand for, this is completely justified. You don't want to be known as the fry cook, the guest server, or the cleaner, or whatever it is, it doesn't matter. The important thing is, is that you don't like it, and it doesn't fill you of any confidence. I'm not dissing those workers, and I bet you there's a lot of people who are completely content being in those roles. The point I'm making here, at some point in your life, a career did not fit you. It did not fit your idea of yourself or your self-image, therefore it affected your confidence. I got my first job as a fry cook in high school. I felt really good about it. Having dough roll into my bank account for the first time felt freaking amazing. I had that job for about two years and during that time my position on that opinion completely changed. When I got older, I was out of high school at that point, I did not feel good about my position. I felt like I could be so much more. I felt not only stuck, but lesser than for having that job. This, the mindset, affected me a lot more than the job itself. I positioned myself lower than my friends, my family, and relationships just because of my job. Of course, I eventually moved on to other jobs and other doorways and things just moved on. Which, now I can say, if you're able to be honest and okay with where you are, where you work and be proud of what you do, is such a great benefit to you. Don't get me wrong, it's all psychological, but that shouldn't matter to you. If it's a benefit, it's still a benefit. But I'm going to tell you with my own experience, having a job that fits me better or makes me more money made me a whole lot more confident. I had better friendships, I had better relationships, and I was more fun to be around because I just had more confidence. This conclusion with everything led me to believe that your job, your role, your career has a major impact on your confidence. And I shouldn't need to tell you why confidence is so important because it's just so great for your mental health. I would also like to add that everyone I've ever met wanted to contribute to something in their life, something bigger than them. Whether that be work, relationships, or religion, it doesn't matter. They want to be something bigger. So if you're not proud of what you do or what you stand for, it's hard to be confident. This is now a very common problem nowadays because let's face it, a lot of the jobs that we work is to make a living, to make a paycheck. And a lot of these jobs making higher money do have that fulfilling role that you make a lot of money. You're thinking you do something important. But let's just say you don't deem it important or make a lot of money. Your confidence will plummet. You're afraid to tell people that where you work. You start to dread people asking you what you do for a career. And it's not really great for your confidence because that's a really big conversation starter. As much as we hate to admit it, work on what you do is a really big part of you. You spend a good third of your time doing your job. So it is a really big part of you. So I have three solutions to this. I'll start with the first one is get a different job. I mean, it sounds so simple. Just go find something else to do. It's not that hard. You won't feel as complacent anymore and you have something new to do. The second thing is to understand it's okay to be where you are right now. You're going to change in the future. As long as you're not complacent, I think that's perfectly okay. My last solution is if you're getting paid quite well, but don't really enjoy what you do, it's just don't make your life your work. Create great barriers where your work begins and your work ends and enjoy the, your life outside of it. Have hobbies and do whatever else you want to do. And there's a lot of people that will fit this role because overall we just want to afford the basic necessities of living life and sometimes that means we have to do something we don't really want to do. That's all I have for today's video. If you like this kind of content, a subscription would really help me out. A like and comment, make this video reach out to more people who need it. And remember to love yourself so you can save yourself.